The Horseman's Corner is an original production of Howard Hale Broadcasting, on the air since 1994 with over 7,000 episodes with people involved in the world of horses. I'm Howard's son, Brian, and we welcome you to The Horseman's Corner. I'd like to invite you to visit the website that we have for The Horseman. That's horsemanscorner.com. Good place to advertise, good place to go if you're looking for horse information. That's horsemanscorner.com. Let's continue that conversation with Wyoming breeder Randy Dunn on the history of the Blue Valentines. He starts off talking about Chip Merritt. When Chip had all of his mares, he had a, a horse called Gooseberry that he would brought over here, and then a son of Gooseberry called Plenty Fry. And then we had another son of Blue Valentine called Brianna Rojo, and then we had a horse that Merritt's was raised years ago called Deer Rip, and then we would got another son of Blue Valentine called Bluesbeard, so that's kind of how we had all the all the Blue Valentine, and, and when we decided to have a sale, we just came up with Come to the Source, because you take any horse that has Blue Valentine papers, or goes back to Blue Valentine, they all came from the Merritt's, you know, they, they had all the Blue Valentine. And then we started with the Driftwoods, and then any horse that has Orphan Drift in it, who's, who's pretty popular. You know, we had all those Driftwood mares that were all Orphan Drift daughters from Randy and Stanley Johnston. So we started blending them together, and, you know, there, there are two horses, Blue Valentine and Driftwood, that have just been around forever. The cross between the Blue Valentine and Driftwood, they just complement each other. That's Wyoming horse breeder Randy Dunn. That's going to do it for today's Horseman's Corner. There's more on the web at horsemanscorner.com. Thanks again for listening and may God bless. I'm Brian Hale.